It's a really magical place. Like our motto is the best place on earth. From my perspective, that's totally true. And that's because kids are free to be themselves here at the BC Lions Easter Seals camps in Squamish. Camper David Shoring has no problem finding his voice here. I can Squamish. I mean, to have fun. I mean, got time out. There's something to do. There is always something to do. Staff who welcome disabled children ages 6 to 17 years old every week in the summer keep the good times rolling with plenty of safe and fun activities ranging from water parties to arts and crafts. You just let them come have a week where they don't have to fit into these uh, prescribed boxes or social norms that maybe exist out in the real world. They get to meet other kids that are going through the same things that they are. Also, they get to come and meet staff that just see them for who they are. How many kids do you usually see over a summer? Generally around 350. Camp coordinator Andrew Nechtel introduces me to North America's first wheelchair accessible tree house, providing a whole new perspective on kids with disabilities. We don't focus on the uh, disability that they have. You want to treat the kids like kids, treat them like people. That's what they are. They're capable of making their own decisions. They're capable of doing things on their own and I think a lot of the time people forget that. Thanks to this incredible 33-acre facility, which boasts unique infrastructures like a wheelchair accessible pool, kids can feel capable, confident, maybe even as powerful as a superhero. This past new camper weekend, there's one girl that came through and she was blind and she made it all the way up to the top of the rock wall with uh, the guidance of her counselor. It was really inspiring to see. So what are some of the disabilities and challenges that kids face here at the camp? Well, we have a wide array of kids with different disabilities coming through our camps. Um, some of the more uh, common disabilities that come through would be autism spectrum disorder, Down syndrome, fetal alcohol spectrum disorder, muscular dystrophy. Kids' lives are changed here, especially for kids like David, who at 18 years old will be graduating from camp this year. A lot of these kids value the graduation from these camps more than their high school graduation. David would agree. How much will he miss camp? I will miss as I get 100 times a year. Yes. I wish that everybody could get a chance to come work here, or volunteer, or just even see how it runs for a week, because uh, I think if everyone got a chance to see what happens here, I think the world would truly be a better place. Making it so one happy child at a time. From Squamish, I'm Nicole Fitzgerald for Shaw TV.